channel. For you today in this video is some Huda Huda Beauty Liquid Matte Lipsticks. This is what the packaging looks like. I picked up seven of the lipsticks. Picked up seven of the matte liquid lipsticks. This is the standard packaging. This is what it looks like. I'm actually rocking one out today on my lips. Um, also, I don't know if you guys notice, I colored my hair. I wanted to do something different for, for fall and winter with my hair color, so I just went ahead and colored it myself today. And I really like the color. It's so shiny and pretty. It's like a dark cherry color, so I'm really, really loving the color right now. Let me know what you guys think of my hair color. I actually like it better than what it did look like, so... Alright, so let me just go ahead and start showing you the lip colors that I have. As I mentioned, I am rocking one of the colors on my lips today. It's one of my favorite shades that I did get from the collection. The shade that I'm wearing on my lips is called Video Star. This color is really, really cute. This color is, this color is a lot different than the other shades that I have here. This is more of a bright pink shade. As you can see on my lips, they do dry to a dry matte. The formula itself is very matte, so you do get slight drying effect. I do recommend moisturizing your lips before you use these products. The one little thing that I don't really like about the packaging is that the actual container that holds the lip liquid in it is kind of deceiving on what the color itself will look like. So if you actually look at the packaging, you can see that there's ty a type of glare to the, the, pack, the lipstick itself. That's like one of the things that I don't really like. I don't really enjoy the smell of the product, but overall the shades are really pretty. So the lipstick that I have here, as I mentioned, is Video Star, and the shade is so bright, so pigmented. It went on really smoothly, so they can run outside of your your line that you have on your lips. So I do recommend applying these really, really carefully, or it's going to go outside, <laughs> outside of your lipstick, outside of your lip line. Another thing that you can do to try to avoid that happening is possibly using a lip liner. I don't have many lip liners. I have a lot of lipsticks, but I don't really normally use a lot of lip liners. I, I feel like it's an extra step for me to have to do every day when applying my lipstick, and I think it's a pain in the neck for me personally, so that's why I normally don't use them. On my wedding day, I did use a lip liner just so I can have the lipstick that I wore wear a lot longer. That's another plus of using a lip liner is that it does tend to have the product itself last longer. So that's always a good thing to use your lip liner for, but me personally, I don't normally use one. As mentioned, I advise for you to definitely try out the product, but be very careful. Use a lip liner if you need to. But the packaging, everything else seems to be fine. The product itself is really good. So I'll do a quick swatch of that. So that's the first shade here in the color Video Star. The second favorite shade that I picked up is Bombshell. This shade is also a bit different from the other lipsticks that I have here. I feel like the other ones are kind of in the same family, in, in the same family, which is like the red family. So this one is a bit brown. I really like the packaging on this one. You can kind of tell what the color looks like. It it is a pretty wearable brown. Once again, I don't like the smell of these. The taste you really don't taste them because they dry so quickly. You don't really taste them. So there is Trendset. So there is Bombshell. Next shade is Gossip Girl. This one's a really pretty red. I like this shade a lot to wear in the winter time. So this will definitely get some usage. It's more of a brick red, but can be very wearable. As you can see, the formula is really, really nice. 
shade is a bright red. This one is really cool. It's called Cheerleader. This shade is your... This is a fire engine red with a hint of orange in there. This one's a bit a bit runny to me for some reason, but I tried the shade on itself and I really liked it. So there's Cheerleader. The shade is Trophy Wife. Nice mauve purple color. Really pretty. There's a swatch of Trophy Wife. It's a gorgeous Christmas color. It's in the shade Icon, and I would definitely want to wear this for Christmas. Just the color of it reminds me of like Christmas decorations. It's so pretty. last shade is Famous. It is the darkest color that I picked up. It's a dark, dark plum purple. The shade is so pretty. It is a bit dark for me since I am very fair as usual as you guys know. As you guys know I'm very fair so this shade is dark for my complexion but I will definitely rock this color. I don't care. And it's that shade right there. So these are the overall colors that I picked up. I did ha I did pick up another one that I'm actually going to include in a giveaway. So stay tuned for that. I have gathered a couple of the products that I've been picking up lately into a small giveaway for you guys. I'm almost at 1,000 subscribers now, so I'm really excited about that. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. Um, if you're wondering about my shirt, um, it's actually a sweatshirt that I picked up from... It's a, I actually got this shirt from my Forever 21, and it's really cute. I like the striping on it. It's really soft, comfortable. I like how it really like hugs me. <laughs> I have a bit of a shape, but um, it's really cute. I, I've been rocking this in the fall, in this fall, so I really like that. I, I do believe you can still get this sweatshirt at your Forever 21. I know that every Forever 21 has different clothes everywhere you go, so I'm not sure if you'll see it at your local Forever 21. If not, jump onto their website, forever21.com, and you can check out and see if this is still available. I think I got this on sale when they had a mini sale going on online. Um, I think I got this for like $15 or so, or, or it could be could have been less than that, but it was about a month ago that I picked this up. Hey guys, so that's about it. I just wanted to show you some of the Huda lipsticks that I got recently. They are great, great. They are great products. You can check them out at your Sephora now. They are available there. They are. They also just came out with a beautiful palette that I want to grab. So I think I'm going to pick that up once I, once the VIB sale goes on, which is. I think it starts the 11th, so Friday, November 11th. The VIB sale will start for all of the VIBs. <laughs> I got my um, discount in the mail, so the 20% off will start on Friday. So I have a list of things that I'm going to pick up from there. So stay tuned for me showing you guys what I picked up from my Sephora. If you have any additional questions of anything, um, please leave the comments down below. And please don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.